What is a housing bubble and why do they burst? A housing bubble happens when housing prices skyrocket and real estate values become so unsustainably high that eventually the bubble bursts. Housing prices are disconnected from what are called intrinsic property values. Intrinsic property values are prices based on economic factors like income levels, rental costs, and other things that traditionally influence property values. Skyrocketing housing bubble prices occur when several things happen at once. The number one biggest driver of a housing bubble is speculation. Speculators buy properties not to live in a rent but to flip by selling quickly and at a higher price. When speculation makes people feel that prices will rise indefinitely, it can lead to a bubble where people keep buying houses at increasingly higher prices as investments. They're banking on the fact that their house will continue to rise in value. The next factor to contribute to a housing bubble is limited housing. When more people want to buy properties than properties exist to sell, the price of the properties that are in the market can shoot up to match that rising want, leading to rapidly rising and unsustainable prices. The next factor is interest rates. If interest rates are low, housing bubbles often get even bigger. Low rates mean people can afford bigger mortgages, further driving up demand and prices. Buyers may take out riskier loans without heeding warning signs like increasing interest rates or shrinking economy. And then there's herd mentality. People see big money being made in the real estate market and decide to jump in, leading to a buying frenzy. By the time that all these things happen together, the bubble can become really big. When you're in this bubble, it can seem inescapable and like the market will never change. But all big bubbles have to pop sometime. Housing bubbles bubbles burst when the factors supporting them like low interest rates or unsustainable price increases change or stop. Bubbles can go on for a long time, decades even. Some bubbles deflate slowly while others experience rapid crashes. When a housing bubble bursts, it's called a housing market crash. The crash results in plummeting housing prices that can cause financial distress for homeowners, investors, and housing sector professionals. A housing market crash can even propel whole regions or countries into an economic recession. There have been many housing market crashes, but the worst was the 2008 financial crisis. While the crisis was triggered in the US, repercussions rippled around the world, leading to a mass amount of job losses and foreclosures. Predicting when a housing bubble will burst isn't easy, but there are a few signs to watch out for. Interest rates. If interest rates rise sharply, it can be more expensive to get a mortgage, which can lead to a decreased demand for houses or condos. Mortgage debt. A shrinking economy with job losses can mean homeowners struggling to make mortgage payments, an increase in foreclosures, and a decrease in demand. High levels of mortgage debt compared to income because people are buying more expensive houses than they can afford, can make homeowners vulnerable to even small economic shocks. Increased development. A rush of homes being built during a housing bubble can result in an oversupply, leading to a rapid drop in prices, especially as the economy slows. So if you're considering jumping into the real estate market as an investment, remember that nothing is permanent. So consider all the factors of the current economic state before you make any major decisions. And now you know what a housing bubble is and why they burst. Thanks for watching this episode of TVO's What is Explainer? If you enjoyed this video and you want to watch more like it, you can click around me. And if you want to support the channel, you can click the like button and subscribe for more educational content. If you have any suggestions for other things you want us to explain, you can tweet me at 500 Days of Ariana. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.